because this boy murdered my son and ain't no charges of murder against nobody. A WAND News exclusive now. A Decatur mother on a mission to find justice for her son as the man once charged with his murder is about to be sentenced on a reduced charge. WAND's Chris Carter sat down with her today and joins us now with her message. Chris? Well, Don, it took just minutes for the Decatur woman's life to change after her son was killed in late 2019. 30 year old or Ernest Wren was shot just blocks from his mother's home. Tonight, she's upset that justice is not being served in her son's death. <laughs> Him coming in my house, Mom, what you cook? That's all he said, Mom, what you cook? Memories. I can't believe he's gone. I can't believe it. Our treasures for Mary Woods. This is kids. Her youngest son, Ernest Wren, killed in October of 2019. Can't bring him back, so I don't know. Wren's killer would be arrested within minutes of his death. In an October release to the media, police said Deontay Merriweather was arrested and booked for first-degree murder. Court records no longer show murder charges. Instead, Merriweather is scheduled to be sentenced next week for unlawful use of a weapon. This boy murdered my son, and... Ain't no charges of murder against nobody. Why remains the question. According to sworn statements, Merriweather admitted to shooting Wren, but said it was in self-defense after Wren was able to get a gun during a fight. Wren's mother finds the new charges painful, calling them an injustice. My son got murdered. How come he ain't got murder charges? That's what I'm talking about. All I do is think about my son. That's all I do. I'm waiting for him to walk in the door and see him again. But I don't never see him. Through her tears, she finds courage, though. This a man is still dead. He can't speak for himself. Courage to give her youngest son a voice, to bring justice to a father, brother, and a son, in hopes of putting the person responsible behind bars and keeping other families from feeling her pain. He gonna get out of jail, and he gonna think he bad, and he gonna come back and kill somebody else. His kid, because he got under his belt that he done killed my son. Her memories of her son serve as a drive to push forward. And I ain't got nothing but pictures now. I can't do nothing but look at him. He's dead. He's gone. Ain't no coming back. And to raise awareness of a justice system she calls flawed. Can't sleep at night. This don't make no sense. And I'm sick of it. And I'm not finna lay here and take what they saying. They need to do something about it. And I can't. Believe gone. I can't believe it. The Merriweather is scheduled to be sentenced next Tuesday. We have reached out to his attorney for comment, and we were told that they don't discuss cases with the media. Macon County State's attorney has not responded to our question about why the charges were changed on. Chris, you know, you feel her pain. Do we know if this case is closed? Are there any other suspects? Well, you know, we don't. I reached out to Decatur Police. They told me that they had no comment, so we filed a public records request asking for information on the case. I was told in a denial that releasing the information could actually hinder the investigation or the suspect's right to a fair trial.